up next, a UFC welterweight division matchup. one of the more accomplished strikers in this division. Sprawl and brawl, whatever you want to say, he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. It does not matter how he accomplishes it. All he wants to do is be on his feet and at range, hitting you with the beautiful jab, staying away from the grappling exchanges. You don't accomplish all the things that this man has accomplished over the course of his career without understanding distance. He has great distance management, which then in turn allows him to land all these beautiful diverse kicks, spinning back kick, jumping high kick, so many things he possesses that he will try to use tonight in this fight. Yeah, if this turns into a kickboxing match tonight, most it's people over. believe, yeah, his opponent is in a it's world over, of JK. trouble. Well, pretty much every time out in the UFC, DC, this man has put on a striking clinic, and that is his methodology coming in here tonight. He'll try to keep the fight on the field. And that's why we tune in, right? That's why we tune in. We tune in to see guys that are dynamic. We tune in for the speed. We tune in for the knowledge of the striking game, the ability to set traps, the ability to find the jab, the ability to find the right hand, the right kick, the left kick, the knees, the elbows. He truly uses every weapon that he has in his arsenal to try and finish his opponent. You make one mistake, night's over. You cannot make mistakes against a guy that has the striking acumen yep. of this guy right here. And the jab is not as underutilized a weapon as it was in MMA, say, five or seven years ago, but he's got as good a jab as anyone in the business, and that is where all of his striking flows off of. We'll see how it goes for him in this matchup tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City, Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet, eight inches tall, weighing in at 156 pounds. Fighting out of Newcastle, England, Assassin. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet, eight inches tall, weighing in at 160 pounds. Fighting out of Hong Kong, Mr. Untouchable. Okay, guys, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your So here we go with round one, classic matchup of striker versus striker. These guys have both faced a lot of grapplers in the past. They like the draw tonight. Oh, yeah, they love seeing an opponent that will not be trying to dive at their legs. They know when they get to the center of the octagon, the only steps back they will take is if they choose to move out of range to re-enter back into the striking realm. It's a very comforting thought for both of these competitors. Perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Great punch. to establish that jab.
Oh, big left hook there. Just unable to quite find that range. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Oh, nice kick right there. Tell the masses how, how good that feels to get kicked like that. Johnny does. <laughs> it doesn't feel good to get kicked like this. Oh, huge block. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Just misses with the jab there. Back to the body shots now. That one blocked. Maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Big call punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Two minutes to go. Come on, man. Let's get that takedown. Score some points. Yes. Oh, and he caught the kick. Nice kick. Doubles up on the jab. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Single collar tie there. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Whiffs on that offering. So we crossed the 30-second mark in our opening round. And he caught the kick. That's a big strike right there. I mean, he's cutting down the size with these beautiful legs. Back and forth we go. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Well, what a round it was, and how about that flying Superman punch at the end of the round? Not a lot of fighters will try it. He did, he executed. And it worked, right? No discouragement from his opponent to make him not try it. Why not try it? It's working, so why not try it again? If his opponent isn't careful, he will get knocked out and be on a highlight reel for the rest of the time. Big leg kick lands. Oh, combination lands. You want to talk about putting strikes together. Beautiful execution. There. And every one of them are landing. She's overwhelming him with different attacks. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook 
behind the right hand. Jab, right hand, hook. That's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man. Let this guy have the whole thing. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Lands with the right hand. Punch over the top. Over and over, he landed these big body kicks. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Checks that leg kick. Beautiful body kick. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Good punch land. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Big kick land. Oh, beautiful head movement. Slips there. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Let him go. Let those hands go. Beautiful strike. Boy time club. Leg kick. I see the power tie now. How about that shin? Both guys really throwing with authority. Straight right is there. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. Nice punch lands over the top. Uppercut lands. Whoa! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh! And he continues to work the body here. No loopy punches. He's going right to the target. All right, so he lands another punch there, and he smells blood in the water going right back at that cut. Absolutely. The opponent has a lot of scar tissue around the eyes. He was able to cut it open, and now he's just touching it over and over again. Oh, and he caught the kick. And they separate. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault, and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. Thirty seconds to go in this one. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. 10 seconds remain in round two. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's gotta press it. He's gotta go take that finish down. How about those five minutes? All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed a seminal blow in that round. It was accumulation of those strikes. He kept hitting over and over to the head. Eventually, he found the, the one that really did damage his opponent.
Third round underway. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Oh, what a punch. Look at the force behind that leg kick. His leg is hurt here. You can see him limping a little bit. Oh, and he caught the kick. Relax, relax. Keep Big head. kick. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Misses again with a right punch. Nice punch lands over the top. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. Really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Oh, nice knee to the body for him there. Very nice. Now, there's danger in that, too, because when you start reaching on to catch that kick, here comes the high kick, and then you're in a lot of trouble. Goes to the body with the knee. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Massive head kick! Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. What a punch. Oh! He's hurt. He's hurt bad. Now look at him jumping in to try to get the pin. Oh, he got hurt bad! And we have passed the midpoint of the fight. Postured up there, gained some valuable separation. And now, the ground and pound start. Strong plot of work here, staying busy. Big kick. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting him up now. Nice one-two there. his blocks. Oh! oh, big left. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Out of range with that one. Done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over. Oh my goodness! <laughs> yeah, that right there is a high-level knockout, ladies and gentlemen. Crowd absolutely loving it. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Landed flush. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming. So a huge, huge win for that young fighter here tonight. Well, another highlight for the real DC as we look back at that scintillating knockout. Yeah, but the whole fight, he was landing great strikes, kicks, punches. He was doing everything right until eventually he found the shot that ended the fight. So there he is after a monumental knockout turned in here tonight. That is one they will be talking about for quite some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at 3 minutes, 55 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Mr. Watch, there he is, the man of the hour. What a massive...
massive knockout for him to get this win in style tonight. He did everything he needed to do to find the knockout. Now he can celebrate with his family and friends as they earn this spectacular victory.